We're in the Porsche 911 Turbo S and we're in the, the beautiful Spa Francorchamps in Belgium. It's really cool to be back. Uh, this year I spent most of my time in America with Porsche. Uh, it's now again my first race in Blancpain and in the Intercontinental uh, GT Challenge and it's really nice to see a lot of uh, known faces and uh, it's really nice to be back. Uh, it's, I'm really looking forward to this race. It means a lot for me. It's in Belgium. I won it in the past with Audi. Uh, now I would like to win it with, uh, with Porsche, so let's see. Yeah, obviously very clear uh, to win. Uh, we're here with a Porsche, uh, with uh, Team 75 uh, from Timo Bernhardt, and uh, we're with three Porsche works drives on the car, and our goal is clear to, to win it, no doubt about it. Uh, it will not be easy, uh, but uh, let's see. It's quite different, obviously, like most of you guys probably know, the engine is on a slightly different place, which, uh, which makes life quite different and, uh, and the handling of the car is different. Uh, but at the end of the day, once you're used to it, it's a race car. And uh, I think it's quick. On the official test day, we, we obviously finished in the first position, which is a good starting base. Uh, I think it's definitely a car which also suits to Spa, so I hope it will do good. Now we're going uh, to La Source, first corner of the track, first or second gear. Is this your car? Is this your car or someone else's? It's my teammate's car. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to a Rouge. I'll take it easy, like I said, it's my teammate's car. I think he will, uh, will kill me. He told me he doesn't have any rear tires anymore, which I can clearly feel. <laughs> So this is all Rouge, uh, yeah, I think a lot of drivers would say the best corner in the world. It's just, it's so quick, it's blind, uh, when you come on top of the hill, uh, you make one mistake and, and, and you know you crash, so it's, uh, it's one which never gets boring in the race. No, I don't really feel pressure, because uh, I won it two years ago, it's actually more a comfort, you know, this, this race already stands on my, on my Palmares. Uh, I don't have to prove anything uh, here because I won it in the past. Uh, it's more, like I said, a comfort and it gives you confidence to, to fight for, for another victory. You're in the double left, also a very quick corner. <laughs> Which is obviously... <laughs> like Kevin said, he doesn't have any <laughs> rear tires anymore. <laughs> You're having fun now, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. I might slow down before this goes wrong. <laughs> uh, yeah, Spa is just... Uh, I don't think you can find any driver here on the paddock which doesn't like Spa. Uh, it's, it has everything slow at speed, high speed, elevation. Um, and to do a 24 hour race here with the biggest CT3 championship in the world uh, is simply one which I think everybody wants to win. Uh, it's the biggest achievement you can you can have in, 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 in GT racing. Uh, so I think that's why everybody's here. All the brands are here uh, to, to win this and uh, everybody will want that, that big trophy on Sunday. Hallo iedereen, ik uh, ben heel blij weer in, uh, in België nog eens een wedstrijd te doen. Vooral hier 4 uur van Spa. Ik denk de, de grootste wedstrijd uh, in GT die er is. Uh, ik hoop dat jullie aanwezig zullen zijn. Uh, Ik heb mijn best doen om, uh, om een zo goed mogelijk spektakel van te maken. Hi Blancpain fans, uh, I'm really happy to be back. Uh, brings back a lot of uh, cool memories. Uh, 20 hours of Spa, uh, which one uh, do you want most? Uh, it's the biggest GT3 race in the world and uh, happy to be back racing also uh, in Belgium. Uh, I hope I will see a lot of you guys uh, over here in the weekend and uh, wish me luck.